Hello YouTube, uh, I would like to show you two knives I bought from China. Um, it's not the best decision, um, as I see by part of the picture it looked better. Um, I like really opinion knives and uh, I thought ah, let's uh, check it out. Maybe this would be really cheap equ equivalent and maybe it would work fine. So for comparison uh, this is number 8 garden, which is a bit bigger. And of course the blade also is much bigger. This is around six centimeters and this one is around eight and something. Yeah, eight something, eight four. So just for comp comparison, uh, but the knife came, um, I had to a bit redo them uh, because when they were opening and they couldn't get even to this position. So here in the end I had to make a bit more uh, bigger hole, I removed a bit of wood and this one for example is now opening fine, but the other one um, I think I would have to cut a bit of the metal here uh, to open it completely. But anyway for like 2 bucks or I don't know how much it cost, it was like uh, 1 euro 50. Um, yeah, it's a just knife to use and throw away. Um, anyway, it can work fine. Let's try it. Oh, it's really sharp compared to Opinel. Opinel is also really, 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 really good knife, really sharp. So at least this one works fine. Let's try the other one. On the picture, uh, it wasn't rosy you know, like this. It was red, like uh, uh, more at your classic. It's pretty sharp for the price. I'm surprised. Uh, price and uh, what you get comparison ratio. Uh, it's really good. I'm just not sure about there is no locking mechanism um, because you would if you would do something like this it can happen that it will close on itself. Let's try it uh, with some wood. How it performs? So when I'm pushing, there is no way it will close. When I'm pushing here with the fingers, then it can close like this, and then I can close it on my finger. I won't do that, <laughs> not even for YouTube. Let's try something like this. If it will close, I'm holding my fingers this way, so when it accidentally closes, I won't get cut. So actually, you can use it also to drill holes, it's not closing. Uh, one small mm, hint is maybe uh, when you want to hold it uh, tighter, just uh, take pliers and squeeze this part, then uh, it won't open as uh, easily, or close, I mean, it won't close as easily. Like uh, with other knives, uh, I'm used to uh, put finger here and push, but with this one, the technique cannot be used. Maybe with the other finger. Let's try off the other one.
and just to have a comparison now I will lock uh, the Opino So, if I would have to decide, this one was a few times uh, more expensive, but I wouldn't share it uh, or wouldn't change it for uh, this. No way, because they are so cheap. Even uh, this one it was like mm, 8 to 12 euros. So, that's the price I'm willing to pay. If you really have no money, you can also use this. Or um, if you are afraid you would lose your knife and uh, you just need little, little small tasks, then it's uh, good enough. But anyway, I would always go with the Opino. This is like high, high, high quality and security. Thanks for watching. As you can see, three quarters of ounce. Uh, it's super lightweight. It's like uh, Victorinox uh, um, Classic SD. It's 21 grams. Yeah, so yeah, it's the benefit is that it's super lightweight, and the same goes for the other one.